to create something is to make something special. For example, a painting from ordinary things like paper and paints or an amazing model from bricks. Today, we are telling the very first story in the Bible where God creates something very special. Let's hear what the Bible says about creation and open the book to the story, This is Good. Day one, God said, Light. 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 And there it was, just like that. Not sunlight, not starlight, but pure light. Bright and white like an empty canvas. God set the light on one side and called it day. He set the darkness on the other and called it night. And there was morning and there was evening, a first day. And God looked at what he had made and said, This is good. 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 Day two. God said, Sky. Sky. And there it was, just like that. And it was bright and it was blue. Above it, there was outer space. And below it, there were the seas. And there was morning, and there was evening, a second day. And God looked at what he had made and said, This is good. 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 Day three, God said, Earth. And there it was, just like that. The waters parted before it, and there was land, and there was sea. Then grass sprouted, and trees grew. And flowers blossomed. And there was morning, and there was evening, a third day. And God looked at what he had made and said, This is good. 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 Day four. God said, Sun. And there it was, just like that. Then God said, Moon. 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 And then, for good measure, he said, Stars. 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 And the blackness of space was sprinkled with light and blinked and sparkled and shone. And there was morning, 
and there was evening, a fourth day. And God looked at what he had made and said, This is good. 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 Day five. God said, Creatures of the sea. Creatures of, of the, the sea. And there they were, just like that. And the rivers shook and the seas swelled with their leaping and swimming and splashing. Then God said, Birds. 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 And they burst through the clouds and their cries filled the skies and there was morning and there was evening a fifth day and God looked at what he had made and said this is good, good. good. day six God said animals And there they were, just like that. Hooves hammered, and manes shook, and trunks trumpeted, and it was good. But it was not yet good enough. There was something missing. Well, some one, actually. Someone to enjoy all this goodness, someone to care for it, someone to treasure it, someone to write songs about it and to thank God for it and to look after it and to make beautiful things from it. So God spoke again and what he said was people. And there they were, just like that. And there they were, just like us. And there they were, like God as well, made in his image, to love, love, love. to talk, talk. And to dream, dream, and to write, write, and to dance, dance, and to build, build, and to have children and fill the world as well. And there was morning, and there was evening a sixth day and God looked at what he had made and said this is very good very good day seven God rested and when we have been busy making and doing and taking care of his world, God wants us to rest too. Creatures of 
Christians believe that when God created us, he wanted us to be creators too. There is something of God in us when we create things. True, we can't make the world out of nothing like he did, but Christians believe that God gave us the imagination and the ability to write and build and sing, to think creatively about a problem or challenge, and so much more. He gave that to all of us, each in our own special way. Take a few moments to think of something you have created. It might be a new game for the playground, a song or a rap, a drawing or something else. Think about how good that felt. Now I'm going to say a prayer and if you want to make it your prayer, say Amen at the end after me. Dear God, thank you for our wonderful world, the sea, the sky, the creatures and the people. Thank you for the people who have enriched our world with their creativity, clever inventions, beautiful paintings, tasty food and rhythmic music. Help us to find our own spirit of creativity. Amen. Amen. Amen.